Hey guys, it's me Ryan Marquez and I just want to wish you guys a Merry Christmas. Today's video is going to be how to catch stocked rainbow trout on trout dough. I'm pretty sure that you guys are experts at catching trout using various lures but there are some days where the trout won't bite using crankbaits, using mini jigs, using trout magnets, cast masters, the whole nine yards, power worms, everything. A lot of the times the trout won't bite. So with that being said, I want to make a video for you guys on how to catch rainbow trout on trout dough. There's a lot of trout dough out there and one of my favorite trout dough companies is from Patsky and they make a very nice trout dough. They are UV enhanced glow, glitter trout bait, new and improved five times stronger. Smelling the power bait from Berkeley compared to this, this one's a lot more stronger. How to fish with the Patsky fire bait is really simple. The rig of choice I like to use is a Carolina rig. Attached here is my main line, a four pound test is a 132 ounce sliding through that main line and what's stopping that is a nice little swivel and beyond that swivel is attached is my leader line which is three pound test fluorocarbon and at the end of my 12 to 16 inch leader line is my fire bait itself i roll that bait in a ball and I uncover my size 10 mustad hook. I want to cover it perfectly so the hook is not even exposed. So if you look around, my hook is not exposed when I cover it with my Patsky Firebait. Because a lot of the times the trout are very finicky and when they see a hook exposed or whatnot, they're going to be a little bit more wary of biting that bait compared to if they don't see a hook. The theory behind putting the trout dough in a ball is because a lot of the rainbow stock trout, when they are in their hatchery, they are fed pellets and the shape and size of those pellets are a little bit smaller than this. However, the shape is circular. So when the trout dough is in their water column, the trout are hungry, they're going to be very, very accustomed or they're going to be looking at the bait that they're familiar with. So this next clip is going to be me throwing this specific rig, this Carolina rig, on the Firebait Patsky trout dough and catching a rainbow trout just for you guys. All right, hope you guys enjoy. Roll it up like in a dough, in a ball, and then cover that hook. And since the trout are just cruising the along the shoreline you just throw it out there that's pretty much it got one on a trout dough oh there's a mean guy Gonna yeah, try to put him in that little crevice. Nice, like two pounder here. Keep constant tension on that rod and really tire out that trout. And keep the rod tip down. Oh, he's like. He's gonna break. I have no net, I never really bring a net. But on that trout dough, Carolina rig, ooh. Right there, right there. Oh. There you go. Power its head and we have all the leverage in the world. Nice little three pound trout right there. 
Nice one. I'm gonna gill it because it's a stock trout, but very, very nice rainbow trout. Look at that hook set. Perfect. <laughs> this guy definitely wanted it. I see some trout cruising along the shoreline and this guy wanted it. Super cool. Super nice. There you go. There's the sunlight. Alright guys, I hope that video helped you guys catch your rainbow stock trout using Trout Doe. I just want to give a, a quick shout out to Chris Schaefer from Patsky Bait Company for hooking up with the products and definitely hooking up with the fire bait. I don't think I would have caught in that trout if I wasn't using the fire bait Trout Doe. That day was pretty hard in general trying to film and trying to catch some mini some trout using mini jigs but as soon as i switched to trout dough that nice size rainbow trout bit mine so i hope that help that video helped you guys i want to say merry christmas and happy new year definitely be safe out there and always fish on see ya throw your bait out there guys and definitely you'll get bit without trout bait it's awesome just 10 yards away from shore Swimming, trout swimming the shoreline. It's a pretty cool sight to see.